child the guy first he was trying to get me to buy four new tires and i'm like no that i need the double caffeine okay just somebody else don't, don't come around here with your judgment damn everything that i want everything that i desire is already mine right here because baby it was a blonde pixie it was one for the books if you know you know if you remember you remember Sheena with She Is Fab and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Sheena and she does all the things. If you're an oldie but a goodie, hey girl, hey. Hey girl, hey. You know how we do. I have this bun and it is big. <laughs> so happy Tuesday. I'm headed to work. I know y'all hear that humming noise, but your girl needs two, 
well I need one new tire um, for whatever reason the tire on the front passenger side has worn down um, but it makes no sense to get one new tire so I'm gonna get two new front tires um, and they they had to order my tires because child the guy tried to well let me just back up tell you a little backstory I have a um, Mercedes C300 and I have staggered wheels so that means my wheels on the back are bigger than the ones in the front so I know um, maintaining that is quite expensive because I do drive a lot and I risk that my tires can't be rotated they can only rotate um, side to side so the front can go on they can rotate and then the back can rotate but you can't rotate like all four tires because they're two different sizes so I'm really unsure as to why only one tire wore down I probably need an alignment but child the guy first he was trying to get me to buy four new tires and I'm like no if my back tires are still good why would I buy four new tires make it make sense sir then he tried to sell me two tires that were not the tires that I have on my car so you want me to ride around with Mitch Match tires sir that is ghetto okay we will not be doing any ghetto behavior like that I mean and no shade to the girlies that have to do it because I'm not saying I ain't never did it before but I am in um I don't have to do it anymore let me just put it like that so long story short um he only had one of my tires in stock so he has to actually order the other one so it'll be in today or tomorrow so the humming noise should cease because child he said the thread was about or the tread is it thread or tread whatever it is it's about to pop out on this tire over here so that should be resolved soon so today um the tires aren't in today that i'm gonna go and get my um nails done um before it gets too busy of course thursday is thanksgiving um i think i'm gonna wear red nails for the rest of the year so i'm gonna get some red nails get my toes done because child my toenail popped off last night well not my toenail i, I don't wear like tips on my toes but I do get an overlay and the overlay chip last night so I need to get that fixed so we'll do that uh, well, when I get to work I'm gonna call make an appointment with my nail tech see what time she can take me today I have to pick shell up I'll probably pick her up tomorrow yeah probably tomorrow or I'll see how late it is after I get my nails done but you know by six o'clock child it feels super late because it gets so dark um so early in the day now so anyway guys that's all i've been doing child i've been adulting okay adulting spending my money on adult things <laughs> but i am super grateful that i get to spend my money on those things because you know gotta you listen you can't be around here live in ghetto child you know do the best that you can and then once you start to do better do better girl do better but listen i at one time was a single mother of four small children so i get it i get it so anyway headed to the office um just listening to a podcast i have been heavily listening to um level up podcast um if you've seen my most recent vlog then you know why if if not go back and watch it girl but yes this um, season of isolation for me is all about Sheena. It's all about my um, level up journey, which I am leveled up and I never, I have never stepped out of my level up journey because a level up journey is exact, exactly that. It's a journey. It's a lifestyle. It's something that you continue to do. But I do feel as of lately, you know, I was not giving myself the attention that you know I deserve hence you know why I broke up with my boyfriend and all those type things is because your girl was she woke up okay <laughs> okay she's woke <laughs> as they would say she's woke so but yeah I'm super excited about Thanksgiving um we had tried me and Lish had tried to convince <laughs> my mama to go out to eat but Miss Mary wasn't having it baby Miss, listen Miss Mary is spoiled okay spoiled so um i ordered some boudin rice if you know you know child from pie burns um and then um nicole is making a cake so 
that will be my contribution. I'm gonna bring some uh, Grey Goose because I'm not buying Ciroc no more. We ain't fooling with Diddy like that because I wanna make some um, espresso martinis. So, but yeah. All right, guys, let me go in here and get to this shamani and I'll talk to you girlies later. Bye. Hey, y'all, so happy Thanksgiving, okay? Happy Thanksgiving. Um, I cannot believe the year is almost over. Um, I'm dressed, getting ready to head out to my mom to my mom's house. I'm waiting on Shelby. Um, we're gonna drive out there. I, may, I need to stop and pick up Miles, um, and then we're gonna head to my mom's house to um, have Thanksgiving dinner. Um, I'm gonna stop by Popper's, if you know, you know, and pick up some of their boudin rice because that's gonna be my contribution to dinner. Child, I did not cook. Um, I got a cake from Nicole and I'm gonna bring a bottle of wine. <laughs> that's all Sheena got on Thanksgiving dinner this year. Um, and then that's about it. Uh, I probably won't vlog, just um, spend time with the family. Um, for those of you who don't know, um, last year Thanksgiving was <clears throat> the last day that um, I saw my son alive. Um, he died the following Monday. So we're gonna just spend this time enjoying each other. Um, of course, thinking about my oldest son. Child, what is it on my sofa? Oh, nothing. <laughs> um, but yeah. So just gonna enjoy the day with my family. I do have to work tomorrow, so I won't be out late. Um, tomorrow is gonna be a busy day. I have to get tires for my car. Yes, adulting, which I don't want to do. <laughs> but you know, I'm grateful and thankful that I'm able to put new tires on my car. So um, so yeah, I'm just waiting on Shell to get ready. My arm is tired, so but um yeah, I don't have anything fancy, some jeans, my Aritzia bodysuit. These earrings are from H&M. I actually picked them up um, when I um, got the dresses the other day. I just forgot to tell you guys. This is a new lippy. Um, it is by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I do have a haul. Well, not really a haul, but I did pick up some things from Sephora and Ulta. Um, I can show you those guys. I can show you those things later tonight or tomorrow. Um, but yeah, um, Ulta had their Anastasia lippies, um, 50% off. I will link it down in the description. So far, so good. It does remind me of Lady Balls by Too Faced. Um, but for some reason, I cannot like. I get lady balls all over the place. It's never like a true, it's matte, but for some reason it, it just, it'd be all up on my forehead child. But my pink lipstick, my, my, um, what's happening or it's happening. I always forget the name of it. It doesn't do that. So I don't know if, and it's not a, it's not a bad batch of, um, the Too Faced is, I don't know the matte just of the red, Lady Balls just never stays really matte on me. So this one seems pretty matte. Yeah, like it's not moving. So I will link it down in the description if you guys are interested. I didn't see a pretty pink that I um, that I liked. So I just picked this um, red one up. And then I just have on my Joisa watch and my Amazon bracelets. So and this necklace is from... Um, a boutique in New York City when I went to New York City so but anyway and I'm probably either gonna I just have on jeans this this is old I think this is from Target old 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 either gonna wear my New Balance or my Birkenstocks so but yeah guys I hope you guys have an amazing Thanksgiving love on your family um, enjoy your family um, and yeah let's get ready for this holiday season um, because child it ain't waiting on nobody uh, I'm going to probably do my tree this weekend, but I'm going to record it and then that will be one of my um, vlogmas videos, kind of like a decorate with me. Um, I don't know how many more Christmas decorations I'll be getting, but um, I want a, a centerpiece for my coffee table or for the bar, either or, because I'm going to move one. 
if you saw my other vlogs and you know I like the way the centerpiece from my bar or from my pencil, peninsula area looked on my coffee table, um, I'll probably pick up a few coffee more a few coffee table books. I talked about that in my my last vlog. I want to get some more stems. Um, but I don't want to get too many knickknacks or chotskis or however you say it because I don't really have anywhere to put them because I don't have a dining room table. Um, I want to do a little bit something in my entryway. Um, I want to, you know, shop with intention. So I want to make sure the things that I'm buying, I'm using, not just using them and then storing them away because I don't have a lot of room to store things. Um, I did order a 65 inch TV. That'll be here tomorrow. So I need to um, get with someone about putting my TVs up. Cause I'm gonna put my TV up in my room and then my TV up here in the living room. I'm not gonna put Shell's TV up because her, she has a tall dresser um, in her room. So, but yeah, here I go rambling. And um, I've done a few things in my bathroom. Um, I put my shower curtain all the way up to the top and it looks phenomenal. So I'll I'll show you guys that as well. But me putting the bathroom like together, like doing a reveal, I think that's gonna be part of Vlogmas as well. Cause I have a few more things I need to do in there. But I will show you guys how it looks just to give you guys ideas for if you have a small bathroom. I, it feels so much larger um, with me just doing that shower curtain trick. So anyway. If I don't see you later today, which I doubt, I doubt if I vlog, I'll see you girls tomorrow. Hey y'all, so happy Saturday. Oh man, it looks like it's gonna be a beautiful day um, outside. So first things first is, your girl is gonna go work out. Um, I have made plans to go to the gym. However, you know, there is a gym in my apartment complex. So I think I'm just gonna go there, do a little bit of cardio, and then a little bit of legs. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get my day started. So on today's agenda, let me fix you guys. Um, I'm gonna be going to Craft Text and I'm gonna do that right after the gym. Um, it is quite a ways from my house. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that out of the way. Um, that is the place that Nicole and I went to last weekend. I don't need any Christmas decor, I'm, I'm going for the home decor and the coffee table books because I'm trying to put together um, uh, content for Vlogmas and one of those will be um, decorating my place and um, probably a home decor haul. Um, and then I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna straighten up my place because it is a hot mess. Um, <clears throat> water my plants because they looking real mad at me right now. Um, I need to edit or start um, to edit this video so it'll go up tomorrow, which is Sunday. Um, and then I plan on taking myself on a solo date tonight. Um, oh, I need to go by Trader Joe's because we need flowers. I've been making that a priority of mine. Hold on, let me get my... I know y'all probably think I'm crazy, but child, I have not worked out in so long um that i need the double caffeine okay just somebody else don't, don't come around here with your judgment um currently i'm letting my airpods and my apple watch charge that should not take too long but that is what is on today's agenda um i need to get back into working out getting back into um keeping this body that i paid for or at least my tummy tuck um keeping it looking good child and I gain weight first in my face and in my arms that's where I can see the most weight gain and that's when I know I need to push back and get back on my fitness I'm not going to be hard on myself I am going to give myself grace because I do work I consider myself working two full-time jobs my nursing career and YouTube child because I am dedicated to both okay um 
So I am very busy. I am a mom. I am a sister, a daughter, a friend. So, but I, I need to inco start incorporating moving my body more. Um, one of the reasons that, well, it, it, that's an excuse. So I'm not even going to go there. No more excuses. Okay. Um, but yeah, that's what is on the agenda today. Let me go ahead and start drinking my energy drink. Oh, I don't have any more straws. I ordered I, I ordered some more glass straw. Well, I, oh, maybe it's one in the wash. I need to wash dishes, y'all. Don't judge me, judge somebody else, child. Yeah, they're, all, they're all in the sink. I have a, a sink full of dishes. So, um, but, but like I said, when I get back, I am going to wash these dishes. Last night, I just came home. I made some lemon drops. They were so good so good but i can't be making too many of those because of the sugar and the calories child but they were really good i did get my tv i got a 65 inch tv um they are coming on monday to put that on the wall so i need to get my place spiffy um so i don't have too much to do um on tomorrow and when i come back well you know i go to work on monday i go to my full time I go to my nursing job on Monday. So, but anyway, it is the weekend. Um, we are going to have a fantastic weekend. I was just jamming my girl TB, Tony Braxton. I love me some Tony Braxton, y'all. Fun fact, I met Tony Braxton. If you know, you know. Um, me, Bestie, me and Bestie went to her concert and we had VIP passes and we met TB. She's a sweetheart. So, but anyway, that's enough of my rambling. Let me go ahead and get this workout going oh and if you're wondering what i'm wearing you guys have seen this jacket before it is by lululemon way of lauren i did steal out her closet these are lululemon tights um and this top i think i got it from the first store and then i'm just gonna put on my new balance and yeah i'll see you girls at the gym Take it away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I want to be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love. All right, guys. So my workout was really, really good. Um, I have not worked out in, I don't know, the last time, child. But... Life be lifing. The key is to get back up, okay? You might fall down, but the key is to get your butt back up. Remember who you are and get your butt back up, okay? We all lose sight you know fall off a little bit because child life be life but don't stay down for long i think i said that before in one of my vlogs I probably said it several times <laughs> so now it's time to run a few errands got my coffee with my protein shake so it's 8 31 i'll probably be where i need to be within about 45 minutes to an hour just depending on what this traffic is doing so i don't plan to eat <clears throat> until about lunchtime. i'm going to use that as a meal replacement well that's the goal so yeah i will see you girlies in a little bit Hey y'all, so happy Sunday, happy self-care Sunday. Make sure you are making today about you, saying no if you need to, resetting, recharging, reclaiming your time, sis, because you can now pour from what? An empty cup, okay? You is number one, you is the prize. Say no to whoever you need to say no to, that man, them cheering, them family members, them coworkers, your boss, whoever you need to say no to in order to get back to Number one, get back to whole, get back to you, because you, you can't do nothing for nobody else if you don't take care of you, sis. So, 
happy Sunday. So I'm just having some coffee. Um, let's do a little recap. I think the last time I saw you guys was yesterday morning. Um, I went and I worked out. I had a fantastic workout. It felt so good to get back into the gym. So mentally, I had made all these plans, child, to go on a self date. I mean, to go on a solo date to clean my apartment. And I did not clean this apartment, y'all. It is terrible. But anyway, um, to go to Trader Joe's, I just made all these plans. And then um, some things set in. <laughs> some things set in if you are not new to my channel then you probably know what things set in um and uh i don't want to call it a depression i'm going to call it more of a sadness um that kind of kicked in and just kind of took over that went into the evening that went into this morning and here we are now at 12 12 okay um about an hour ago i had a pep talk with myself I got out of the bed, did my makeup. I took a shower. First thing I did before I said before I did anything else because doing my makeup always makes me feel wonderful. Um, I did my face, and then I said I was gonna come on here and talk to my girls. Um, I was hoping to have the video uploaded by now, but I did do a little um, editing, and I need to get a, get a little bit more uh, footage to make it you know, a longer um, video, more of a weekly vlog. Um, so it will go up later tonight. Pro well, fingers crossed, because you know, sometimes internet be tripping, but fingers crossed. Um, I'm gonna leave this house. I'm gonna take myself to brunch, um, maybe do a little browsing. I don't think I'm gonna do any shopping because I really don't per se need anything. The uh, One of the biggest items that I needed was a TV. I think I did mention that um, I got a 65 inch TV that um, um, I got a company that's gonna come and put it on the wall for me tomorrow. So the only things that I need um, that I wanna get before the end of the year will be a nice rug and some drapes. I do need dining room furniture. I haven't quite decided the look that I wanna go in there. So I'm definitely going to wait till after the holidays because that's where I have my tree. So I'm not too much focused on that. But those are the next two items that I wanna get on my list um, and um, for the home. Um, I did ride out to Craft Text. I did get two more coffee table books. So I have a total of three that I need to show you guys. Um, and then some other things that I want to put together for a home decor haul. So, um, yeah, I'm not going to sit around the house today. I'm not going to be out late because I do want to refresh my apartment, um, and get ready for work tomorrow, but I'm not going to sit in here all day. I'm not going to do it. I've said before, feel what you need to feel and then get up and get moving. Um, not to say that um, you grieve how you need to grieve. I grieve every single day. Um, I'm just not going to, um, I'm just not grieving because the anniversary of my son's death um, will be next week. I grieve every single day. Don't, don't get that twisted. But there are other things that are going on in my life that have caused me to be, um, a little sad and we ain't crying today because girl i look good i look good okay i look good and i also know that everything that i want everything that i desire is already mine um it's flowing to me um the doors are open i'm ready to receive everything is in god's timing okay but baby y'all see the beats y'all see the beat y'all um so yeah just my regular makeup i did not do anything different um I have been using the, I, I did I did a little bit of shopping at Ulta and Sephora and I will do that haul, um, but I got the Donna Karen um, deodorant and yeah, y'all, y'all know I'm kind of late to the train. I be, I be hopping on things real, let me answer this text because, um, hold on y'all. I be hopping on things real late. Um... but I am loving it. Um, so, but yeah, I did get a few other Lux products. 
that I've been wanting that have been on my wish list. I did a little bit of treating to your girl. You know, I treat myself every day, child, but listen. <laughs> okay, so we'll do a little haul on that. But I'm trying to decide where I want to go and have a brunch. Um, try to decide because I'm not going to leave the area that I live in. Um, I live in the Woodlands area. Um, either I'm going to go to 60 Vines or Cheesecake Factory. I can't think of anywhere else that I might want to eat at around here. And then I have a return for Ross. I'm going to go to Trader Joe's and get my flowers. That's a non-negotiable. I need my flowers. Um, I did get my tires, by the way. So that's done. Um, so yeah, like I said, it is 1217. I want to be out of here by one back home by no later than 334. But yeah, um, let's see message for the week for my girlies. So, um, as you guys saw, cause I know I added it in. Um, I did, um, work out. Yesterday, I didn't get a chance to go to the gym today. I just was not feeling it, but I will be setting my alarm clock to get my butt up in the morning and go before work. Um, fall down, but get back up, okay? Never stay down long. Feel what you need to feel. I think I've said that before. I've said that in several videos. Um, we are human. We are going to go through ups and downs and peaks and valleys and highs and lows. That's all about being human. Um, but one thing, um, when you are on a journey of becoming your higher self, leveling up, um, becoming that woman, okay, because we ain't girls, babe, we are women, okay, we are seasoned women, so we're not trying to be that girl, we, we've been that girl, right, we're, we're, we're becoming that woman, um, you feel what you need to feel, get it out, talk to somebody if you need to, um, don't talk to somebody if you don't want to, but process it, feel it, um, and then figure out what you need to do in your life to move on, to um, go to that next level, to unlock doors of joy and happiness that await you because God promises, okay, joy and happiness for his children not suffering, not depression, and not anxiety. He doesn't want those things for us. A lot of times when we are going through those things, we bring them on ourselves because we forget to be grateful. We forget to be thankful. We focus on the negative instead of all of the positive, okay? So go into this week with a positive spirit, okay? A positive mind. You ain't letting nobody, no thing, no one, steal your joy because your joy is your joy someone steals it it's because you allow them to come in and steal it your joy is your joy your happiness is your happiness you control it you control it sis y'all i look cute <laughs> no i'm just playing but i that's one of the things that i do when i want to feel good about myself like no lie an hour ago i was just in my feelings okay i was woe is me and now i've put on my makeup i'm about to get cute and i feel good so figure out what makes you feel good do those things for you i took myself on a little luxury body care makeup shopping spree those are the things that make me feel happy so i did those things for myself flowers make me feel good fresh flowers i'm looking at my roses from two weeks ago they are dead dead and I'm looking at them like, why haven't you thrown those away yet, Sheena? They still sitting there. But I'm going to throw them away today and I'm going to get me some fresh ones. So, um, and everything is not always about um, spending money. Let me be very clear. Um, journaling, scripting, excuse me, saying my affirmations have brought me so much joy this week. So, listening to music, taking a bubble bath, having a glass of wine, being by yourself, like just... Focusing on you are definitely things that you don't have to come out of your pocket for, sis, to make you feel good about yourself. You determine what 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 it is you need to make you feel good, okay? And I also want to say thank you, if I haven't already, for all of the beautiful, 
And I have not had a chance to respond because we had Thanksgiving and I had to work and then I was kind of down in the dumps, but I promise I will respond back to every comment, but I have read every comment and I just want to say thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart for just receiving me as me, receiving me as my authentic, vulnerable, at times silly, at times crazy. Y'all, y'all, y'all can describe me perfectly. Like y'all are so good at that. So I just want to say thank you um, for helping me build this platform, um, this safe space for us women um, to just be ourselves, be our authentic selves. And I love reading the comments. I love when you guys say you chose you, you changed your mind, you know, you got out of a bad situation, you left a job, you know, you are focusing on you. And one of the comments really stood out and she said that, you know, um, you see me with every good thing that I have going on in my life. And then I can also open up about what is not so good in my life. I, I'm not, I'm not here to fake the funk with you guys. I'm human. <laughs> I'm human. And I'm not here just to show you that my life is perfect because it's far from perfect far from perfect. But do I have a lot of goodness and greatness in my life? Absolutely. Do I have a lot of do I have a lot of wonderful people um, in my life that are rooting for me, that are cheering for me, that support me? Absolutely. But I also do know that I have to be my number one cheerleader um, and support myself and uh, learn how to love on myself um, if I want to see if I want to attract the things that I want in my life, I have to treat myself how I want to be treated. I have to show the world um, that this is me. This is who I am. You're going to treat me right. You go, you know, all those things, all those things. Um, I did get my egg chair. I mentioned in a couple of videos back. So I will be putting that together in a, in a vlog for you guys. Um, just so much goodness is going on in my life. And, um, I want to thank you guys for being here with me. Okay. So let me go and pick out an outfit, child, so we can hit the streets. Mm, 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 mm. And I did do some Black Friday shopping. Actually, I shopped before Black Friday because the sales actually started um, before, um, before Black Friday. So I have some stuff from H&M and Fashion Nova coming. So yeah. All right, let's go get dressed. All right, guys. So I am headed out. Just wanted to show you a quick little OOTD. Um, I am putting together some fashion footage for all of my girlies who followed me because of my fashion. So um, yeah, you might see this again in a, another video. Um, but this top is from Walmart. It is a mock turtleneck. I love it. Y'all have seen these jeans before, X plus wear, and then I just have on my New Balance and my YSL bag. All right, I'll see y'all in the streets. Bye. Y'all, I wanted to show y'all my new shades from Amazon. I love, love, love these shades. They look so good. Um, I need to see if they have them in silver. I definitely need a silver pair of shades. I know my favorite, um, Bottega dupes, they come in silver. So I'll probably order these in silver. But I was thinking about actually finding the Bottega, um, the real Bottegas, because I love, when I tell y'all I love these shades so much, but does it really make sense to buy the Bottegas when the dupe is so good? I don't know. Y'all let me know down in the comments what y'all think. But just wanted to show y'all these. I don't know if they're a designer dupe but they are so good but anyway trying to decide where we should go eat but in the meantime in between time we're gonna jam out to some mariah did i show y'all my nails i love them Ooh, red for the remainder of the year y'all okay back to mariah I never should have let you go I would ever be without your love
talk to you guys or been on camera since um, Sunday. Um, I made all these plans to do all these things on Sunday and yeah, um, I did take myself on a solo uh, like brunch date and then um, I wasn't quite ready to come home. So I went to um, Faces, which is a spot here. Um, it's in Third Ward and um, I realized that I, I really needed to be out of the house. Um, I ended up seeing Helen. Um, Helen was, um, she was across the street and then, well, what happened was I saw my um, old hairstylist, her name is Mika. If you remember when I was blonde in the city, if you know, you know, um, if I can find a picture, I'll put it on the, uh, I'll put it on the screen. But um, she dyed my hair blonde and baby, what I tell you, okay, the kids, <laughs> the kids were like, it was a moment for me. Um, my blonde hair, my blonde era was a moment. Um, but I could no longer continue to do the blonde because I don't like dark roots. So she was literally dyeing my hair um, every three weeks and then I was getting a perm like, like, cause I, anyway, when I wear my hair short, it has to be straight. I don't want short curly hair. I want, it was a blonde pixie. It was one for the books. If you know, you know, if you remember, you remember. But anyway, I ran into her. And she was um, with Helen's sister, Pam. And then Pam was not too far. I mean, not Helen was not too far. And then she came over. Anyway, long story short, it is exactly what I needed. Let me tell you about the God that I serve. He will give you what you need right when you need it. And I needed to just be out of the house. Um, because Saturday, I ain't do nothing. Um, I sat in here. And then on Sunday, I felt like the walls were just closing in and I needed to get out the house. I ended up having a really bad breakdown Sunday night. Um, and uh, Nicole came over. Um, let's just say I'm finally becoming more of myself. Um, yesterday was the anniversary of my son's passing. So Lauren literally flew in for three hours. Um, we went to the grave, to the burial site. Um, Lauren was so close with her brother. Um, it just broke my heart because I, you know, I gave her time alone at the grave site because um, she hadn't seen, um, she hadn't seen it. Um, and it was just like, I, I know he was my son. I birthed him, but that was Lauren's baby. Um, she told me, she said, mom, the day you brought him home, I knew I had to be his protector. Um, <laughs> I don't want to get emotional, but yeah. So today's Wednesday and I need to close out this vlog <laughs> so I can get it up. So I can go ahead and start making content, um, for December. I'm going to do my best on vlogmas. I'm not going to put a lot of pressure on myself because I just don't need to do that. Um, I need to learn how to navigate through these holidays without my son. So, but I'm, I'm going, I'm going to put out some videos for you guys. I promise. Um, but I wanted to come on and close out the vlog and then do a haul with you guys. I've been picking up quite a few, um, beauty and, um, uh, body care items. One of the things that I said that I was going to do was, um, just, I love to take showers. Like showers is my thing. I think I showed you guys how I'm transforming my bathroom. Um, by the way, this robe is from Amazon. It is just like the white one that I have. It is so comfortable. It is that, um, what do you call it? Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Like the robes you wear at the spa. <laughs> um, it, it'll come to me and I'll put it on the screen, but I also have body towels like that. And then my shower curtain is also waffle. It is the waffle material. It is so good. And this is from Amazon guys. I do plan on investing in something a little bit more luxurious and expensive for myself for Christmas. So once I find her, I will definitely let you girls know. But in the meantime, in between time, this is, she is soft. She's soft, but I, I will link it. And then I had on another like light pink or dusty pink 
um, fuzzy robe. That was from Ulta. I got that as a free gift because child, I've been buying everything or, and everything from Ulta lately. But anyway, so I've um, been investing in some body care. And these are things that you guys have been telling me about and putting me on. But I'm, you know, I'm the type of person, I don't jump on bandwagons. I'm going to buy it when I want to buy it. So I was in a spend some money type of mood. So, and I've used some of these products. So the first one is the Necessaire Love Her. Smells so good. I've been using her in the mornings because it's, I got the eucalyptus scent. So this is the first product. Really, really love this one. And then I also got the Way that I pretty much use like maybe on the weekends. Um, I'm a huge believer, proponent of don't, don't be waiting for special occasions to use your things, child. But I have so many body washes that I have so many in rotation that I can really like, unless I just want to, you know, put it on in the evenings when I get home. But this is pretty much my weekend body wash and this smells really good too, guys. Yeah, this smells really good. I believe this is in the, oh, it is. It's the Merrill's Place scent. So I also have um, the body scrubs. Um... And also have the the body uh, the lotion and the is the lotion the lotion is more, more like a rose scent. Hold on, let me go get it for you guys. Yeah, it is in the Melrose. This is the body um, cream, but this this has like a really rosy type smell to it. But this is so good. Yeah. So these two together, Chef's kiss. Okay. Okay. And then I also picked up some body oil, because child, when I go out for these holidays, your girl's gonna be glowing, okay? Now, I do have the oil by, what's that one that everybody bought on TikTok? But that one has like a, a, like a seaweed smell to it. Um, I really only use it at night. I don't know if this has a smell, let me see. No, this doesn't have a smell, but I got this more for the glow. Y'all see the little gold specks in that? And again, this is by Kapari. I'll link these um, items if I can find them. But this is the Golden Aura Body Oil with 24 karat gold. Uh, with 24 karat gold plus uh, hyaluronic acid. So yeah, pick that up. And then I also picked up the Donna Karen, perf I mean, uh, deodorant um, that a lot of you have said that you really, really like. Now it does have a very powdery scent to it, but I like it. So yeah, I am a degree girl. Um, I um, tried using like the de deodorants, like the natural, but child, I can't be, they, they don't work for me. That they don't they don't work for me. I, and one thing you will never catch, Sheena, is smelling musty. Okay, mm, it's a no for me. So, but I got the Donna Karen Cashmere Mist deodorant, and then um, I also re up on my Fenty Beauty. Um, I am a three. Is this three three fifty five. That is my shade. Um, I, am, I have not used it because, like I said, I do have a little bit of a tan. Um, I think my natural color is coming back in now. Um, but, yeah, this is my normal shade in Fenty. And this is the um, Pro Filter. And then this is my favorite drugstore. I've talked about this, raved about this, but it's the Maybelline Matte um, Poreless. It's the Fit Me. And I am 335. And this is a this is a perfect match for my skin. So um, yeah, I've been using her. And then I also picked up um, the Fenty Skin. Is this what this is called? What is this called? The Butter Drop. I got some of this. And I haven't been using these things because I was wanting, I've been trying to do this haul for y'all for over a week, but. Um, I'm going to use my things this weekend. Yeah. Ooh, that smells pretty good. Ooh, yeah. So I finally got some of this. I've never tried this. This is the first 
time, but I love anything by Riri. And then just a few just um, regular, regular things. I got the Morphe um, Mini Continuous Setting Mist. I've never used this, so I did get the small one just to see. And then I know they, um, the girls on TikTok were saying, was saying that the one in the gold bottle is good as well. But um, I was gonna, I got the Setting Mist because I picked up the Elf Primer. And I think the um, one in the gold is a primer and a setting spray, if I'm not mistaken. If I'm if I'm not if I'm incorrect, let me know down in the comments. But I didn't feel like I needed both of these. And of course, this is um, highly rated. Um, they said it's like the milk primer, and I have used the milk primer before. I did pick up the Elf. Um, Glow, I mean the lip oils. This I've been using this before, um, like while I'm doing my makeup, just to hydrate my lips. It is very, very hydrating. Um, it has a really nice wand. My wand is a little brown because I get like makeup on my lips. But um, yeah, this is this one is really good, y'all. This is really, really hydrating. Um, I haven't used this one yet, and then I was watching a video this morning. Um, the, uh, she got the brown color. I believe she got this color and she got the brown color. Um, and the brown was really pretty on her. So I may go back and get that one, but this one, I just keep in my little bag, um, just in case my lipstick comes off at work or wherever. And I want to keep my lips hydrated. I have gone back to my YSL, um, mascara. Uh, because I just, I, I was going to do some like at home false lashes. But child, I, it was giving me too much trouble. And I think I talked about why I have not just gotten my lashes done. Because I just don't have that kind of time right now. And because I take my vitamins, <laughs> my lashes are actually really, really long. Now, I will wear a strip if I need to. Um, but I haven't felt the need to wear a strip. Um, I actually have been really loving the natural look and these make my lashes so long. I just need to get an eyelash curler. So let me show y'all. Can y'all see how long my lashes are? So she's good. And then my other favorite, um, is the Better Than Sex by Too Faced. Girl, these two right here. And then, um, I picked up some Morphe concealer i've used this before um and then the the lady in ulta was saying that like this is her all-time favorite she won't even buy the expensive um ones anymore and i am in the shade i believe that says medium y'all i don't have my glasses on but I believe it says medium um i did get an oh because they had uh, um ulta products 40 percent off because some of these things i bought on black friday um but i bought two of these but i'm gonna take this one back because um it's, it's like too light. I don't know if you guys can notice how light my brows are and I have dark hair. I don't think it looks bad, but because I bought two, I'm just gonna go ahead and exchange this for a darker one. And then uh, of course I will use um, the one that I have. And then I picked up one of these to apply my um, powder underneath my eye. And I think that's it. I got these two products free. Um, from Sephora when I got my Sephora order. This is um, Amika's Soul Food Nourishing, Nourishing Mask. So this was a free product. And then this is JVN. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but this is the Air Dry Cream. I don't know what this is, y'all. Like I said, this was free from, they put this in my Sephora bag. Oh, maybe it's a hand cream. I don't have my glasses on. Let's see. I think this is a hand cream. Yeah, I think this is a... It smells good, too. It smells really, like, fresh. So, this would be perfect to keep in my... I think it's a hand cream, y'all. I don't know. I need to read. I don't have my glasses on. Y'all let me know now in the comments if it's not a hand cream. And then, um, as far as what's on my lips today, because I know somebody's going to ask in the comments, good. 
but this is my um sephora lippy i've lip i've uh, linked this before i don't remember the name of it but it is in my like to know it and i will link it and then i went over it with this um gloss by color pop now i don't know the name of this one i will put my glasses on and see if i can um figure it out but this is only like eight bucks but it's not worth eight dollars y'all i mean I, you can't this it's very sheer oh excuse me <laughs> spitting on y'all sorry um it's a it's a mat if i'm if i remember but it's so sheer i like mats that are buildable like this comes out sheer but it's buildable so i feel like Together, these are great, but separate, I I would, I'm not even going to link this because I don't, I don't recommend it. Um, yeah, the formula in this is not really good, but this, she's good. She's buildable. Like I said, you can always put something on top of it if you like a real, like, like, I like my mat to be, I don't like no see-through mat. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want to, I want my lips to be full of color. I want to be matte, child. But anyway, and then <clears throat> I picked this up too. I've used my cellar water before, but I've never used the vitamin C all-in-one brightening. So yeah, I'm trying this for the first time. So, and I really like it so far. It really gets my makeup off. Um, and I wear a lot of makeup. <laughs> so but anyway, guys, that is a lot. I will link what I can um, in the description box, but Thank you guys so much for loving on me, um, holding me up when I really can't hold myself up. Um, I do appreciate it. I read all of the comments. Um, you guys um, really brighten my days on really when I'm having a bad or a dark day. All I got to do is go to the comments and read the comments. And, you know, so many of you don't know me from, you know, a rock on the ground, but you take uh, time out of your day to leave me sweet comments, to comment on Instagram. Make sure you are following me on Instagram because um, most of these things get shown on Instagram first, even though I don't think I've shown any of this on Instagram because I was waiting to do it with you guys. Um, but a lot of what I do, of course, gets put on Instagram first. So I will put my name on the screen it is at underscore sheena is fab so make sure you're following me there um my tv is up but i will show it in the next vlog and baby she looks really good i, I did get a tv um they came and put the tv up the other day so that is up um my egg chair came i need to put that up i have a lot to do i have a lot of content that i need to be recording so when i get home today um I'm going to try to start doing some videos for Vlogmas. I'll, the first video I want to do is my tree. Um, as soon as I end this vlog, we're going to go ahead and start a, another. So, all right, guys. I love y'all so much. Thank you so, so much. If you've made it this far and you like my content, I hope you will consider subscribing. If you are an oldie but a goodie girl, you know I love you. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support. Make sure you leave me a comment. Give me a big thumbs up subscribe, share this video with a good sis, do all the things the other YouTubers tell you to do, and I'll see you in the next one. Love y'all.